It is a see-through, so <laughs> hope I don't forget what I'm going to say. <laughs> so, so basically, uh, thank you guys so much for coming out tonight. I don't know if you guys tried to come here last week. Did <laughs> any of you try? <laughs> if this is your second time seeing the show, you're welcome. <laughs> if you are here tonight and you didn't know this was happening, you are also welcome. <laughs> Uh, so, so funny story, last Saturday, I finished my song, Edges of the World, and the lights go out, you know, I, I die, and then I'm supposed to, mind you, this, this whole opening is for me. I went here, at the corner, right there, and so, yeah, and so what you heard, if you guys were there, was not me being hit by a truck. Which apparently is what you thought. You were like, that did sound like a sound effect. Did I really run that hard that you thought my head hitting this wall sounded like me being hit by a truck? I'm just a old friend. <laughs> so I ended up getting a minor concussion. A minor concussion. Yes, um, it, that was good. I went to the hospital, and my wife met me there. It's fine. Uh, my, my beautiful wife met me there. She made me feel so much better. I don't. I hate hospitals. I don't do very well. So I was that. I was more upset about being there than, than anything. And so she hugged me and rubbed my back. It felt like really, really nice. And, and normally, that's just not the case. So with what, let me. She, she's here. She she knows. So, so basically, what normally happens is, so let me walk you through this. Normally, when someone like is over at her house and they're like not feeling well or anything like that, they're just like, oh man, I'm not feeling. She jumps right at it. She's like, what do you need? Like, let me, what did you eat? Like, how are you? Like, how long has this been happening? I, you need a prescription? Like, I got you. Right? That's a nice friend to have. You think that works being her what, Nene? <laughs> Like, I come over, I'm like, hey, damn, like, I got, like, this thing in my neck for, like, the past two weeks. What do you, what do you think? You should probably talk to your doctor. I'm like, great. But anyways, that night, she was, a little late, thank you, guys. Uh, it was a little late. Uh, that's fine. So she was there, and she was making me feel, like, so much better. And I thought that when we got home, that that would continue. What they don't tell you is that getting a minor concussion is like getting grounded. I got home, I got into bed, I pulled up my phone, she goes, no, 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 no phone. <laughs> what do you do? No, no TV. And don't you dare fall asleep. You just sit there and think about what you did. <laughs> Ready, go to work. <laughs> That's so nice. Um, <laughs> thank you guys so much for coming tonight. I really do appreciate it. Uh, I, yes, and originally I was not the host, so thanks again, pal. <laughs> that was really nice. We got to do this. Um, so when I got asked, no, you can sit down. I still got, I'm halfway. <laughs> I have, I have, have I flipped over yet? No, we're good. Yeah, we're getting, we're, we still got some time. Uh, buckle in. <laughs> So, so basically, um, when I got told that I was going to be hosting, I like looked up some stuff. I was just like, oh, okay, the LGBT community, this is great. Like, got to look up some stuff, get really versed into it. I did not know that you guys had a streaming service, LGBT Plus stuff like this. <laughs> Over here, so I come over with you 
guys. Uh, thank you. This is wonderful. I don't <laughs> God, this is great. Thank you so much. I'm very happy. This is wonderful. <laughs> I didn't really expect that to happen. So, and then I also lost um, 100 pounds. So, oh, doing really well. And then I started watching it, and I'm like, shit. That could have been me. I could really use a house makeover. Like, I get like a haircut. You know, I sit down, I make my dinner, and I'm like, damn it, it's good, they have nothing to teach me. I would be a terrible episode. <laughs> and I thought more about it. I said, what can I do? My wife is always working. That might work. I mean, she does spend all of her time with my daughter when she is home, but I can lie, right? <laughs> like, my wife would be upset. Of course, that I'm calling her a terrible wife, a terrible thank you. I'm going to move over here now. She is over here. I do have to explain it to you. I do understand. She doesn't know what I'm talking about. Don't think. Don't think. Uh, so I'm telling you, and now you just turn it off. Now you're just not helping. I'm like trying to get this through. So basically, yes, you would think I'm like a terrible person for telling you that you're a terrible wife, a terrible mother. Yeah, but you know what? We get a brand new master bedroom. <laughs> In the home office we don't use. <laughs> so that's like a plus. I think she'd be okay. I do. <laughs> now I've lost my place. <laughs> nope, I do have one more thing. This is the last thing. I, I thought really hard about it and I thought just to, you know, make amends that the wall and I would do one last thing for you guys. We do have a duet for you guys. We go together like 